Time of year spending can get out of control. It is a perfect time for Gwinnett County students to go through a one of a kind experience designed to teach them all about personal finances, running a business and life. New at 4 Channel 2's Tony Thomas takes us to Make Believe Town, where middle schoolers are learning real life lessons. What is it we're planning when we go back? Our big B word? A budget. In just a couple of hours, Jesus Jimenez says he's gained a bigger appreciation for his parents and, well, life. What surprised you the most so far? Um, kids, to having children. What about yeah. them? They're going to ask for a lot in life. On this day, Jesus and his eighth grade classmates from Radloff Middle School went through the Junior Achievement Discovery Centers. What does it mean to invest in something? Finance Park. So go ahead and do the application. They learn about everything from banking to paying for utilities, groceries. Okay, you're looking for transportation on this one. And buying a car. Jesus's biggest takeaway? Even in Chick-fil-A, you spend a lot of money each year. 2000 something. It's not just a field trip. We want these kids to be lifelong learners in financial literacy. Gwinnett is the only school district in the country to have a facility like this devoted entirely to its students. In this first year of operation, every sixth and eighth grader in the public school system will visit after spending weeks preparing in their classrooms. All right, you got 1368. Across the building, sixth graders work through BizTown, learning how to run a business and hopefully make a profit. I think we can sell this for about, what, five fifty dollars Cameron Gillian role-played the CEO of Holiday Inn Express. The mission? Sell vacation picture packages. Two, one, smile. And here you go. Enjoy. High-profile Gwinnett area businesses created the spaces. Volunteers help run the programs. How's this going to change your thinking? Um, not, not ask a lot what I need and not what I want. Throughout the school year, 26,000 Gwinnett County 8th and 6th graders will come through this facility. In Gwinnett County, Tony Thomas, Channel 2 Action News.